Alright guys, welcome back to some more Dando commentary. What the fuck? hello? Yeah, hello man. <laughs> Whoops. Alright. So, <laughs> we have Cloud two four nine four here versus Cosmo Star. Damn. Band of Keith and Yugi. <laughs> America. <laughs> So clearly, some Cloud's using some type of artifact to make you feel some kind of way up in this door. <laughs> I reckon he was just bluffing. There's no moral tech under there. <laughs> nope, nope. So go ahead, blind space him. Oh, great. Well, that was a quick phone call. I know. <laughs> Alright, so, uh, artifact should all. Artifact Shadows? Artifact Shadows? Artifact Burning Abyss. Who's right? Oh, I was right. Ah, uh -huh, your face. <laughs> <laughs> I was just mucking around. You don't run out of facts with shit Burning Abyss. <laughs> that magician's so fucking good. Oh, definitely. So good. Sometimes no, they don't even want to attack it. Spellbooks. Spellbooks. Uh, I think it should be hit. I think. Well, that one. No, mathematician. She can go. Shoot. I think you should go to two. Oh my god! Why don't you just call it out and then? Okay. Go ahead and roll a die. Alright. Roll, and it is a three. So he's getting tower. I like tower. <laughs> Tower's so good. Yeah, it's a really good fill spell. This should be an interesting duel. I don't live in the ghetto. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why you would see my dude. He's thinking cop cars jumping by, making that noise. It's a four back row, I mean, come on. <laughs> yeah, I think that mathematician should go down to two. Lower the consistency of Shadows, lower the consistency of Burning Abyss, lower the consistency of a one card black rose. Oh, yeah. You know, if OCG wanted to hit fucking Armageddon, then I'd say mathematician. They wanted to hit Armageddon. Yeah, though. they hit Armageddon back down to one in OCG. The mathematician's at three. Any reason why? Shadows. What the fuck? <laughs> That's retarded, man. Like if, if, if fucking Konami hits my Armageddon Knight, I will kill someone. You don't even need to hit Armageddon Knight. No one's even playing Armageddon Knight. You play <laughs> Armageddon Knight when you can play Mathematician. Like, shit, if you put Mathematician to one, maybe play Armageddon Knight, but seriously. Are you reporting? Yes. Let me know when you Everybody is freaking asking me if I'm recording. Is <laughs> 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 your dad? Uh, kinda. Oh, true, true. <laughs> wow. So, good old fashioned spellbook fashion, just freaking playing with yourself. Wait, what are they used to? Oh, okay, that makes sense. So he went, little boy, search secret, secret, search master's, master search. What? Blue boy. Blue boy? Uh -huh. Interesting. Mm-hmm. On the end. Ignition. Ignition. Oh. Really? Why? He gets, uh, level three. Oh, shit. Four? Wait, does he get four or three? Uh, three, isn't it? No, nah, because when there's there's four in there, but the field spell does it count it's... itself? Yeah, that's what I want to know. I don't know if it counts itself. Uh oh, shit! Oh, oh, okay. Yeah, it counts itself. Interesting. Why did he do that? I would have went ignition on the morale talk, and then morale talk can pop the 
the tower. Yeah. Then you would have had a 21 beater on the film with it. Now you just have two morale talks back there. I really hope that you have a... Uh, uh, oh my god, what's his name? Bagel talk. The red, the red one? Yeah. yeah. Bagel talk. Alright. Mission... T what the... <sighs> really? What the fuck are you doing? <laughs> Hello? With that last ignition, you could have said Beagle Talk, and then you could have ignitioned the... Oh, what the fuck? Dragon will pop the last one. He's wasting a fuckload of resources, man. Seriously, he is. He is just burning through resources. So literally, his background right now is two morale attacks and a Beagle Talk. Like, you're an idiot. <laughs> you're an idiot, like... <laughs> If he gets if he gets over that Shikinaga, you're in a deep shit of trouble. The Nikinaga is really good. That is just That was dumb. That was That dumb. was That was so dumb. You could have went ignition, pop, set bagel top, then ignition, target bagel top, destroy bagel top, set another morale attack, then destroy then summon bagel top more Bagel talk destroyed both the morale attacks. I mean, both of them destroyed both his monsters. Like, you could have done that shit way fucking better. What's your rating? <laughs> not as high. Not as high. <laughs> and then he could have gone into a Pallades. Yeah. And then he could have went into a Pallades. Come on, man. So When I see Pallades on the field, I kind of get scared. Shadal <laughs> artifacts versus Shadal spellbooks. Everybody's just mixing Shadals into everything these days. Yep. What you gonna go into? One on one, okay. As long as he, if, if he has a spell book in his hand, he can negate you. He has, it's like a fucking um. Oh. She cannot get effect. Damn. Damn. Yep. She's like a trap trick trap hole nightmare. He just got, he top decked, he top decked right into the fucking Shadow card. Into the Shadow Fusion, too, so. Damn. Damn. That's a cost, bro. <laughs> oh. <laughs> this guy has 72 rating. <laughs> <laughs> and he knows this shit. <laughs> wow. All right. Really? Oh my god. You get your effect from detaching. No, you don't. <laughs> They're not like burning abysses, bro. <laughs> <laughs> go ahead and call that admin. We'll go ahead and as soon as you hit that admin call, I'm gonna go ahead and pause the video. We're gonna be back. So this admin can yeah. bust up in here, tell Cosmo Star he's a fucking idiot. Oh, wow. Wow, alright. Well, that was fun. Yeah, that was fun. Like, come on, dude. Because at that point, that, that that's irreparable game state at that point. So, yeah. it's just bad. Like, no, adults don't get their effects from being detached. Like, <sighs> idiot. <laughs> alright, and look, at, and you were the high-rated one, too. Yeah. So you got Clouds being bad with artifacts, and you got Combo Star fucking being bad with Shadal. Like, everybody's bad. This is why DM is bad. <laughs> Alright, we'll go ahead and get another new one. Alright, bear back. Right, another one. <laughs> Alright, we're back. So, we got, uh... I don't even know how to say it. Lixus? <laughs> Lixus and Alpha Pack Derek. So, okay, apparently, uh, uh, of course he's in a group. <laughs> team. Damn. He wants a fucking monsters with that back row? <laughs> I know, right? He must be using artifacts as well. Probably. Still recording. Oh. oh. Hello? Alright. Really? Wow. He just saw the mathematician. And he was like, yeah. Like, it's either gonna be yeah, fucking... Shadals or Burning Abyss. It's gonna be either of the two, so... Yep. Scop it up. Like I said, I think Navitation should be hit because it would be a fine hit for both decks. Just lower the consistency of both of them. Alright, we gotta go get another duel. Alright, be right back. Your parents, dude. I can hear them making love. What? Hello? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, we're back. So we got, uh, 
have Rick Trish right here using Cleepwood. And do we got Double Bubble. <laughs> it's spelled weird with Double Bubble. Uh, 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 1321 and 1416. Alright, so Cleepwood. That should be interesting. That's it, I need to learn Yay, this it's a change from BA. Yeah. BA Still should, annoying. BA should also Cleepwood. What happened to Teller Knights? <laughs> Oh! <laughs> <laughs> oh right shit! Damn. You spoke way too soon. And there's that fucking skill drain. Not right now. Yeah, I need to get this too. So fucking skill drain. I swear to God, like, why is that card still at three? I don't know. Can someone please? I really oh, don't know. like that card should definitely not be at three. That trampoline link's gone. Yep, gone. Get that motherfucker out of here. You still might be in trouble though. <laughs> I gotta say, fucking Cleefoot skill drain. Skill drain needs to go. And you know they have their own fucking skill drain. Who? Cleefoot. Yeah. Who? It's like a it's like a new continuous trap card. It's like when you normal summon a level four, its effects are negated to the end phase. Wow. Yeah, it's like when a level four monster is summoned, negate its effect to, to the end phase for both players. Damn. That like ruins every deck. Yeah. So Cleepwood is just gonna fucking kick us in the nuts. Like, come on. Like, can we please stop with this? Deep prison. Damn. <laughs> he is just getting his ass beat. Like, unless you can get that skill drain out the field, that shit. <laughs> like, seriously, skill drain should not be anything. <laughs> Especially with these cliff fields, man. Seriously, huh. like, Skill Drain is always in that card that's like, what is the fuck is this shit at three? But now. Now, it's like, seriously, like, if Konami, if you don't hit fucking Skill Drain, swear to God. I mean, I'm gonna come, I'm gonna quit competitive Yu Gi Oh! anyway, because the power creep's too, too big. I can't keep up with all this new shit. Like, every single time you turn around, there's this new fucking broken deck that just. You know, you gotta throw fucking three to five hundred dollars at the new deck, and the old deck gets worse, it gets hit, and then the new deck is even more expensive, like, fucking Konami is just rolling in it while we are fucking suffering, like, no thank you. <laughs> yeah, no shit. <laughs> I can't take it anymore, I can't. <laughs> I'm not gonna fucking throw fucking five hundred dollars to play fucking Cleplay, like, no thank you. They get they get help with that sacrifice as well. Like for oh, yeah. I think this duel's over. Yeah, I think unless he can get rid of that fucking uh, no, never mind. This this duel's over. <laughs> yeah, never fucking mind. It's duel. It's fucking over. Ouch. Oh, oh. Well, he lives another turn, but it's one turn. He opened pretty nutty. He didn't open up pretty nutty. He just had skill drain. This duel and would be tool. this duel I mean, would, scout. This duel would be much different if he didn't have the skill drain. Or the scout. No. Then <laughs> sacri sacrifice is fucking ridiculous. Like, why did they make an equip spell like that? I know. And look at that. Just... <sighs> fucking ridiculous. Like. Equip it, it gains 300, it's counted as true tribute, it can't be destroyed by battle, and then when it's sent to the fuck, uh, uh, the graveyard, you get to add, like, what the fuck? Who the fuck made that? That's bullshit. Seriously, sacrifice is ridiculous. Like, it's probably one of the most ridiculous equip spells ever. Like, fucking, it's so ridiculous that fucking noble knights wish they had that. <laughs> Re fucking they ridiculous. have nothing like that. Nothing like this card is ridiculous. Oh my god, like take you to Dairy Queen, ridiculous. And it's at three, yeah, ridiculous. But Konami, whatever, make your fucking money off of this goddamn deck. The power creep is getting so large that I think we might actually run into a deck that might be able to fight against dragon rulers. 
stupid ass. Because dragon rulers are just ahead of their time. I say, I say, like maybe in like the next year or two, we're gonna be they're gonna be like dragon rulers at full power. Psh, look at this shit. <laughs> and Akli puts her in like right there with them. They got a killer and they got fucking uh, what's his name? Like they got another fucking killer. Gonna be talking about that on Colonel. Kind of yeah, Colonel. Like hello, like. Is anyone alive right now? <laughs> I'm done. Uh, I'm done. Hello? <laughs> Cleepa, too strong. Teller Knights, I'm sorry. You kind of fell off Teller Knights, you know? I, I, I just like I thought you. I mean, you're not a bad deck, but I just... I, I kind of knew. I knew as soon as Cleepa came out, you were going to get bumped out of the top three. So, yep. I feel you. I love that. I have Teller Knights, too. So, I feel your pain. They're my fun deck. There's three boss decks. Yep. And they're all just so fucking good compared to everybody else. I, I just knew that Tower Knights couldn't keep up. I mean, your your uh, Altair to your uh, Deneb in search is cute and all, but, you know, compared to Shadals who, you know, just get shit back and fusion and shit. Mm. And Pendulum spam. Yep. Compared That's to fucking Kleeput getting their shit searched every turn to skill drain their vanity. Compared to fucking Burning Abyss, they just couldn't keep up, and I knew they wouldn't, so... Damn, I'm sorry. Got your ass handed to you. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and call it <laughs> Wrecked. So we got to see, we got to see, Shadals. We got to see. We got to see the top four decks. Yeah, yeah this, this weekend we got to see all of it. So this is this is this is the meta. This is what you get to see. This do you, do you like it? <laughs> <laughs> is this what you want? Also, double bubbles, uh, high princess pictures, the priestess with the big boobies, not the little boobies. When's the next, um, like, f fairness or format, like, the next, uh... January. You know what I mean? January. Oh, uh, January. Yep, so, December 1st, I I always do my ban list predictions a month ahead, so I'll be doing my ban list prediction on the 1st, so... That's worth it. So I can be the first one up, so when everybody searches uh, ban list predictions for that month, I'll be the top one. I love doing that. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so I hope that you guys enjoyed this episode of The Undo Commentaries. Thank you, Madara, for joining me. Oh, good, bro. Yeah, he didn't DC this time. <laughs> yeah. Sub, yeah. sub, sub, guys. Yep, so link will be in the description. Alright, so thanks for watching. Thanks for all the support. See you guys, uh, not next weekend. <laughs> um, <laughs> yeah, not next weekend. I'll put up a video about it, but yeah, not next weekend. Alright, thanks for watching.